my name is Seth Kweku Bani and today I'm going to show you how to design this. Alright guys, so let's jump into Photoshop and then click on create new and then let's use 3000 for the width and then let's use 1, 2, 3, 7 for the height and then let's keep the resolution at 300 now i want to print it for the person so i'm going to use um, rgb color um, sorry i'm going to use cymk color because i want to print it and i'm going to call it church year theme all right and i'll click on create now i would also go to view and i'll go to new guide layout and i'll click over here set here to 0. 25 and then click on ok so we have a nice bleed over there the first thing i would do is i'll start with my rectangular um two and i'll draw something like this great now i'll double click over here and then i'll choose this particular color code and then i like this one zero two three 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 and they click on okay all right now i will also pick my logo and drag it in there somewhere and then let's resize it make sure everything falls within the space you don't want it to cross the lines that we have created okay also make sure falls in the middle like that and i think this is great type choose your tool and then type uh, my year of all right so let's go to the character and then let's choose quigley all right so guys i'm going to leave this in the description for you make sure the tracking is zero to it and then the size over here is choose 49 over here also make sure it's italics click here make sure this selected let's choose e2 b409 click on ok and drag it somewhere here also type here and let's type over flowing click on your move tool and push it somewhere here and then let's choose morganite morganite bold okay let's change the color to color white and then the font size let's choose one two one and then also make sure it is like this the tracking is zero and then we are good to go now let's push it somewhere here and then let's also make sure a flowing force within the middle of it trying to align it my year off also goes up okay great now let's duplicate the overflowing and bring it down and then let's type laughter now you could see that the head is hidden over there is touching it you don't want it to touch it you want it to come down a little bit this is great all right so that's great and then let's push everything up now pick your text tool and just rule something like that and then you paste in your scriptures okay so let's make sure the scripture is also aligned let's see whether the left is also aligned so it has to be aligned okay duplicate the scripture and bring it down let's just see this genesis 26 2 let's just say that's the scripture 
and then let's click here let's kind of pick the yellow color there and that is it also make sure this is italics and this is also italics very necessary now um, let's give it one more star pick this one let's zoom in make sure the lines are not showing just drag a very thin line like that okay align that one too align the scripture as well scripture is aligned sweet give the rectangle a mask and pick this selection to select it like that pick your brush reduce the size and mask it guys if you don't know how to mask i have a video or a shot go to my playlist and then look for a video that talks about mask and it's a short go to the shorts folder it's quite easy so we have our scripture like this we are almost done with it let's put this this and this in a folder this this and this in a folder and let's call it my year of overflowing and then let's put this this and this in the folder let's call it script and then let's call this one logo now over here we want to create another ellipse over here another shape so hold here click on shift and just draw okay now we see both sides touching it double click here let's change it to color white hold shift and then just move it like that let's see how it looks like let's bring it in a little bit okay let's bring uh, this to also here a little bit great and then click on your text tool and type 20 20 2 click on the color and choose this green color as well we are going to use impact for this impact and then the font size we are going to use 88 sweet let's drag it somewhere here so we can see it let's open it back again let's go to the leading the leading we are going to use 75.67 also make sure your lines are showing and then align it to the middle great also make sure everything scripture in this one is also uh, great great so now we can see everything falls within the line none of them has crossed all the text falls within it and this is how we want it to be guys if you love this video hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel as well. I love you all guys. See you in the next tutorial. Peace.